We're going. It's it's live. Let's see if I can. Yeah, we're going. Um, YouTube changed something so that my chat room is disabled when I start broadcast. Like it's not built into my website unless I change a piece of code every single time. Which is just like super duper. I love that. Because I like the... monitor my chats, you know? For some reason, it's not showing me live on YouTube yet. Is it on mine? Like on, on my website, on here. It's not showing it here on my page on my computer. Sorry, I can't word, think, talk good. It should be showing up on my page. Oh, if I do this, it works. Okay. There we go. I need to open it up so I can open up my chat and do all this crap because like I had it set up all slick back when I was playing that Dreamcast game and then now it's just like Ooh, let's fuck it all up it's like thanks YouTube super duper window capture chat okay Need to fix that again. Great. There we go. Yes, that's good enough. So we'll go ahead and save this. I think my favorite part of the stream is when I'm fixing it. It's the most important part. <coughs> Bless you. Are you watching the stream, babe? On my phone? Are you? No. Will you? Why? Because. At least then someone will be watching it. But won't we hear, like... You can mute it. Can't you run your YouTubes and do other stuff on your phone at the same time like I can? I'm sure you can. <sighs> yes, you can. You just don't know how to use your phone. You're doing it. Are you using the actual app? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, see? Oh, okay. How'd you do that? You just minimize 
Netflix doesn't do that. Wait, no. Nef uh, Prime Video does. I know they do. YouTube does that. Um, I don't believe Shudder or Netflix do that because they suck the butts. All right, we're continuing our quest through China. 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 Remember when everyone was all bent up out of shape about. And he says China like he's from New York. Yeah. Well, he's from New York. Oh, we gotta fix this too. We gotta fix this, babe. Got to fix this. Oh, looks like it is fixed. So what's what's my problem here? I don't know. It, it looked all smooth. the other day when I had it set up, but now toggling sucks. I don't know, man, it's, I give up. I give up. I'm never gonna have it right. All right. Let's play Shenmue. Let's see what we're supposed to be doing. Barber and Lucky Charm Quarter. Three Blade Street. Let's see, what time is it? Babe, can you read a real clock? It's been like 20 years since I've read a real clock, so I don't, Like, I can figure... It's like almost 9, like, 35 or something. Yeah, okay. Really? It doesn't seem that late. Is it 9.40 in the morning? Where's my AM, PM? I guess it's light out. Like, why don't I have a map for this district? What district am I in? I want to get to the dock job. And do some heavy lifting. With... Okay, we're going the right way. We're going the right way. Dueling. I, I think he looks like a dugong. This is my favorite music so far. Uh, we gotta set our we gotta set our levels. See, this is why I need you watching the stream so you can tell me like the sound levels. Like I had the gameplay too loud. Like, I saw my meters meeting. Can you mute the mic? Yeah, why? I just want to tell you something. Hold up. <laughs> it's like, it requires a lot of work. Can you just text it to me? Okay. Like, I don't... Oh, wait. Okay. I, I, I'm, why do you think I don't want Macy watching TV? <laughs> like, it's all... Like, it, that is just the way that it be. They don't think it be like it is, but it do. You think I'm going to be able to find Dugong and get some cash? Possibly. 
anything is posted. I'm still, I'm still mad at that guy. I wasted all my time. Oh, yeah. Um, let's say Matt wants a, uh, who do you assist? A case manager? Yeah, let's say he wants one of them. What all he gots to do? Call in and ask for one? Because he's like, yeah, man, I got that service that you work for. Don't know if you want to say that out loud. Um, it's like, it sucks. It takes me, like, months to see a doctor and all this. And I was like, oh, you need to get yourself a case manager, bro. I guess what my woman does. What? That's funny. Why is that funny? Because you're just like talking up the program. Well, I hear about it all day. Yeah. Well, I know that it exists and that it's uh, what it's for, right? Yeah. I mean, if he's having problems finding a doctor or getting in to see a doctor. Yeah. So, like, you said it took him, like, two months, and it was hell, and all this and that. And I was like, bro, you need yourself case management. And they're dying to get people Signed up. on it. Yeah, tell them to call in, I'll give them the number. Babe, I always get lost. I don't know where Dugong lives. I think I might need to keep going this way. No, I don't want that. I want the next one down. Yeah, it's back here, isn't it? I had I had it set up perfect the other day, and now when I transition the scenes, it like fades funny. I don't, I don't know, man. It's always something. Let's Boggles my mind, babe. Are you fucking kidding me, man? Babe, I bungled it all up. Yeah, I know. Like, what is. I may be functionally retarded. <laughs> I feel like these teenagers that are dicking around with OBS and streams, like, have no problem at all. And I'm just a dunce. I should be doing the 30-year-old boomer thing and just, like, drinking Monster and cutting grass. Babe, the kids get it. The 30-year-old boomer is the 30-year-old that actually has his life together and, like, you know, it's maybe a little paunchy and has, like, a muscle car and cuts his lawn and drinks Monster. One of my favorite memes is the kid in bed, and he's like, Dad, there's a monster under the bed, and then it's the 30-year-old boomer, and he looks under the bed, and it's a can of Monster. <laughs> he's just, like, giving a funny little smile. I don't know. I'll show it to you the next time I see it. Babe, you gotta be plugged into the youth culture. Why? Uh, so that you know how horrible the world is. Yeah, so I can... 
Did I send that to you? Did I send that to you? Babe, don't use that language. Because the microphone is on. I re I'm, I'm representing the you-know-who now. I can't be talking shit like that on streams. No. I was talking over you, so you might not have picked up very well. Not that anyone's fucking watching anyway. But, but watch. Run for office one day watch. Then... Well, that's not the worst thing they'll find out about me. <sighs> this is my favorite part of the game. <laughs> Babe, I messed up already. Making big boy daddy dollars. See, this is what makes it hard. The, like, pushing forward and then left, left, left. Yeah. It's hard on this D-pad. One and two. On, played all three on the PS4. You want to start over? Well, we got like an hour and a half into this. Well, I'm saying, like, for this particular instance, like, holding up on the D-pad, and then when he says left, left, left in rapid succession, or, like, four times, then it's really hard to do with this D-pad. Now, the Dreamcast D-pad, the PlayStation 4 D-pad, it probably played just fine. The original Xbox D-pad, people hate it, but on the Duke, the big controller, um... I liked it. Like, your thumb fits perfect, and I think people are just too stupid to use it. Shintai was tweeting this weekend. Like, for some reason, I get a notification every time Shintai tweets. I think it's because I, like, respond to him, so then it's like, oh, we'll give you more of this. But he was talking about the GameCube controller, which is the one you just used for Korth a minute ago. And he's like, this controller is objectively bad, and anyone that disagrees is wrong. And then there are, like, people disagreeing with him. And, no, I'm sorry. Shintai was correct, and they are wrong. They are stupid idiots, and that is a dumb controller. It was already down, Dugong. But, like, do you remember the controller you just had in your hand and how... How it's got that big green button that your thumb fits on. Okay, well you can use the red one to the uh, left of it. And you can use the gray button to the right of it. But that one up above is hard to reach because that green button is so fucking huge. I don't know, it's stupid. And then it's got three shoulder buttons instead of four. Like, who's, who's the Einstein that came up with that? And then the uh, D-pad is tiny. Just absolutely tiny. Like, you just have to have the most delicate little lady hands for that to be the right size D-pad for you. I wish I had, like, quick access to a uh, Duke controller so you could see the, uh, the D-pad on it. Because I think it's actually all right. I kind of like the Duke. Now, I really like the small original Xbox controller, the controller S. Like, when I got, like, all up the Xbox's ass, um, I was like, this this is a good controller. Like, it wasn't perfect. Like, the black and white button were stupidly placed. Those should have just been extra shoulder buttons. But it was alright overall. PlayStation. Yeah, because the PlayStation's been the same controller since 1995. I like that both the thumbsticks, like, they're not, um, they're symmetrical. 
I don't know why people like this asymmetrical Xbox style so much. But like the camera stick on the uh, GameCube controller, um, it's just a stumpy little nub. Like it works. Now there was like one thing people were saying about it, like the uh, analog stick. It's got like an octagonal shape instead of a circle. So like it having that octagon shape um, does help when you need to get those specific angles. You know, it's like, okay, that's cool. But the rest of the controller is hot garbage if you have adult sized man's hands. Which we both do. Well, and you were using the Wave Bird, which is a little bit worse, because um, it's got that battery compartment. The wired GameCube controller's a little more comfy, but mm, it just ain't it. the The main button layout's stupid, and I'm just I'm sorry, but like all the people that are like defending the face button layout, like you're just objectively wrong. Like, look over here, Ben. You see how I got my thumb right here? It's resting right in the center. So you can get to all these buttons with minimal movement. When you got the GameCube controller, the main button's like this, then you gotta like reach up and over it to get to the X, Y. Or... I think I remember you showing It's stupid. Yeah. That's why like when I use my uh, Game Boy Player, I plug in a Game Boy Advance and use it as a controller. Damn it. I like barely moved any boxes because it's hard to... I have a hard time thinking. I don't think so good no more. Are you still... Do you still have it running on your What's It, babe? Huh. There's some other poor soul watching. Glad someone watched it. How much did they give me? Like five bucks? Who gave you five bucks? Oh, whatever. For doing the job? How many shekels we got? Where does it even appear? Do you see the shekel? Oh, there, 188. All right. All right. Do I want to find Dugong and try to do some more work? That's fine. Where's Dugong at? Dugong. Well, first of all, we need to get what was definitely a Coca Cola in the first game, but now it's just Cola brand cola. Because we did some hard work. Uh, do you think those were Fruitopias? Maybe. Mm, let's get Jet Cola. We're going to blast off. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, you hear it fizzing? I bet those were real Coca-Cola sound effects from the first game. What an absolute mad lad. He just chugs an entire Coca-Cola right there on the spot. Alright, let's get in here. Where's... Where'd we find Dugong the second time? I don't remember. Thanks, babe. I'm sorry. Thanks, babe. Babe, yeah. will you sign into all my social media and start announcing that I'm streaming? Yeah. I'm, do you have Twitter installed on your phone? I think maybe. I'm, I stream live on Twitter, too. I never use it. 
and like people have watched it <laughs> I guess I'm also streaming live on D live um, just another streaming service it made is this dude going right here or is this just some generic dude that's just some generic dude all right I guess I guess we're done here for the day and let's go where's some roll it on the top I know it's back yeah if save scumming wasn't such a pain I'd be all about it get me some dollar dollar wands y'all what are they called yawn what are they used in China like some sort of neon colored toilet paper I think it's yawn. I don't know how to say it. Like Y A U N or Y U A N. U A N. Oh, where am I going? Am I getting into trouble? Oh, what's going on up here? Why can't I talk to anybody? Hey. I don't think so. Where like I had to go walk up to the one guy. <laughs> no. Rooftop fight area. All right, let's do some save scumming. Let's throw down a save in case I bungle it. Where's... Where's Ball? He's probably playing Shenmue 3. Like everybody else? Uh, apparently there's like some sort of controversy. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. People just... Whenever there's shit on a Kickstarter, I don't know, someone is happy. I don't know. I don't know, babe. Someone said something about something, and, like, I don't know. People bitch and moan about everything. They can't just be happy that we're getting Shenmue 3 after 400 years. Is this a fight club, or is this fucking arm wrestling because I do not want to arm wrestle ah here it is it's arm wrestling shh I need to hear damn it Yeah, I'm gonna. Yeah, we're just gonna reload a save because I want my fifty dollars back. I thought it was a fight club. It said rooftop fight area. Thought there was gonna be fighting. It's gonna button mash my way to victory. It's bullshit. It's bullshit. live on the uh there's a good screen cap
to be evil. They got rid of that. Like, they literally made that not their thing anymore. Which, I assure you, is not cause for concern. Um, but it's like 2011. Never use your real name on the internet. People can find you and abduct you and rape you if you're a, like, sweet, innocent child. And then, like, a year later, it's like, please put all of your real information on the internet so that you stop saying things that hurt the wrong people's opinions or feelings. And it's like... Mm. Mm. Okay. But somewhere, somewhere I got saved a screen cap of them side by side. And it's like... But, I mean, that's like... If you're our age or older... Like, and you were on the internet in the 90s. Like, you don't put your real name on the internet. Are you fucking retarded? Yeah. And now it's just like, put put this smartphone app that tells everyone where you're at every minute of the day so they can just, anyone can murder you. It's like, just be a victim. Okay. Ridiculous. It's poppycock. A word you don't hear, hear, hear too much. Absolute poppycock. Guys, all these swiddlers tried to arm wrestle, man. Where's Roll It on Top? I wonder who the other person watching is and why they don't say hi. Why don't you ask them? They've heard me talk about it several times. Why don't you ask them directly? Hey, say Goober, leave a comment. Post in the chat room, please. Maybe their audio is broken. Maybe they're watching it. They're probably watching it on like a PS4 or something. Stupid. I don't remember there being a map. Like, I don't remember this at all. Where's this one for? Ah! There we go. I want to collect all the maps, baby. I want to get all the capsule toys. But do you think the map is that helpful? Yes, when I have it, I can navigate towards these exit points. Uh -huh. That's 100% helpful. Hold on, babe. Hold on, I know what you need. I know what you need. in my car in the truck every time I go anyway this is the worst music I've ever heard in all my days what do you think's back here see I was using the map and I found this exciting area No admittance. Oh, cool. Oh, 
Oh, well, like, what I would do is... What I should do is... Bring up... Shimming two notes. So, come over guest house is in the green market. Just turn that shit off. Uh, come over guest house is in the green market quarter near the exit. Uh, near the Golden Quarter exit. I need to know that. The dock job's in the Workers Pier near Aberdeen. And I can gamble near the dock. So I know somewhere in the Workers Pier is where we found that one indoor roll it on top uh -huh. uh, section. But I, I left that area. Because I know there's other roll it on the tops. So I found another one, but I didn't make a note of it. And then, once I get to like areas, I can, you know, start looking... It is important to make notes. Let's see if anyone's. Nope, still no one. No one on the other thing. Yeah, let's talk to someone. Let's see if we can get someone. See, I want a map for this area. Where do I get a map for this area? There ain't none in here. Do I need to get it in like the previous location? I don't know. Cause so I get turned around in here because everything looks the same. It's like the Canton Cafe, the Canton Coffee Spot, the Canton is like come on. Is this the Gorton's Fisherman? Was it the Zimbuktu <laughs> Fisherman? No. Who's the most fucked up person we can ask? Who's this lady? Ask her. How do I get to the Golden Quarter? Remember that. Left, left, right. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, this is my favorite. That's that's what rap music sounds like to Japanese people. <laughs> Do we need a Sapporo? I feel like that's a real product. That's a real product, right? I know, but you said you feel like it was too, but you didn't know that it was. Can we get some Sapporos? I'm gonna have to look that up too. Who's back here? What was the previous thing you were looking up? Uh, Chinese currency. Is it Yan? I don't know. I never looked it up. Oh, babe. Here's the other roll it on top. Hold on, we gotta save. Oh, shit, we got someone in the chat room. Hey, we got two people in the chat room. We got one person in two different chat rooms. This is Freddy Velasquez. He's the one that I tell you all the time gave me that copy of Cross Swords. I like to laugh at. Look. Cross Swords might sound a little gay, but I assure you, it's the best game I have for the Neo Geo, and it's awesome. Oh, 
No, I do want to play. That's what I thought. But babe, why do you doubt everything I say? Oh, wait, I know what I'm doing. I need to be hitting the blue button. I'm retarded again. Christ. <laughs> yeah. I, I forgot it's context sensitive. Fuck off, leave me alone. Cool, so we can get in game drunk? Sapporo is the oldest beer brand in Japan, founded in 1876. It is also the top selling Asian beer brand in the United States. It is, I mean, isn't, I don't know. Isn't what? I love having the internet and access to just like. Yeah, no, the internet's dope. All of the answers. I used to say that to Anthony all the time. He'd like ask me some really stupid question. I'm like, you realize in the palm of your hand you hold access to all accumulated human knowledge ever. You can have like a 13 year old Indian kid explain any fucking thing that you need to know how to do. And he's just like, duh! <laughs> Yeah, I bet a hundred wing wangs. You did? Yeah, that was the only bet you could make. It was the only bet I could make. I think it's in increments of a hundred. Uh -huh. right. <laughs> does that look lewd? Yes, it does. All right, let's roll them on top. Woo! Did you save? Yeah, I did. So we're just going to reload. You know, in the old days when you had to save scum, you used to have to get up and hit the power button on the console. Playing on the 360 was like the not the wireless controller was a large factor in my decision making process because I fucking hate. Um, and then on Twitch we got Nenson Dubois. I don't know. N e n s o n Nenson Dubois. Cool. Yeah, hundred wing wings is a lot of money. When all you have is like a hundred wing wings. It's quite a bit. Of your shekel stack. Roll it on top. Remember last time we tried like reloading the save a couple times and it kept giving us the exact same results? Yeah, I do. That was shitty. Can I re I bet you I can. Oh, so I was looking at Stream Deck, which is this technology you plug in to your computer, right? And it's like uh, a little keyboard, but each key is a little OLED screen, and you can use it to control your OBS your stream shit and it's like real slick and like you know you hit mute and then it'll change and say it's muted and you can set it to do like a hundred things and it's fucking awesome only works on windows 10 what kind of shit eating heathen is running windows 10 oh, i'm gonna turn my speaker off um i mean i guess a lot of people are running windows 10 yeah but i sure as shit don't How do I get to my thing of thing? We can do a pop out chat on Twitch, right? Do 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 do. I bet I click this wheel. There's two people in the chat? Dang, I didn't know you could just look at... I need to start looking at this stuff more often. You can see who's in the chat. Why doesn't anybody say anything in the chat? 
I don't say anything when I watch streams. You don't? I, I talked to uh, like Balzac the, the other day because I saw him <laughs> asking lots of questions. Um, there's got to be a way to do pop-out chat. But I guess I'm too dumb to figure it out. Oh boy, it sure did. Nensen Dubois says, sometimes I do, but mostly if I want to say something funny or important, it depends. I, I usually don't say much. I still don't really... Well, I do understand. Alright. Like, when you explained it... Remember how I didn't understand why people would want to just sit in the video and chat and watch videos? What did I tell you? Well, then you started streaming and then you started talking to people and then I'm like, oh, so it's kind of like having your friends over playing yes. video games. Yes, it's my online friend simulator. Yes. <laughs> right? That's why I want people to talk to me in the chat because I'm like... <laughs> friends. Right. Well, no, see, I used to stream on Ustream in like 2010, right? And that's when... Like, not a lot of... It wasn't as big as it was. It might have been on Justin.TV, which is what Twitch was before it was Twitch, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I would get, like, 30 people, you know? Like, I would just, like, throw out one tweet and 30 people would show up like that. And it was fucking great. And they'd be like, like, help, how do I get unstuck? And someone would be like, this is how you get unstuck. Yeah. And it's like, cool. And then we'd hang out and we'd shoot the shit and... Oh no. Yeah. That's why I don't really, you know. But then when I saw it, then I kind of understood it. Um. Nensen Dubois says, I don't stream, at least currently, but I do watch a good amount. Now, see, I don't watch a lot of streams. I like doing the streaming more. Um. If the two times I really started getting into trying to watch something on Twitch was. Uh, when Dragon Quest XI first came out in Japan, I was watching a bunch of, like, Chinese people play it. I accidentally thought they were Japanese, mistakenly, and I, like, Google translated it. I was like, how do you like it? And Google translated it, and then they knew Japanese, but they're like, I'm Chinese and I also speak English. And I was like, oh, fuck. Oops! <laughs> hey! Hell no. So, and then uh, when Shenmue 3 came out, I have watched a few Shenmue streams, Shenmue 3 streams, um, because it's something I'm excited about and I can fire up the Twitch app on the shitter and just like, <laughs> it'd be like, let's see what's going on with the people that, you know, have their lives or, you know, sorted enough to where they can uh, start Shenmue 3 right away, whereas, like, I need to do this run with you. We had, what, four years to play Shenmue 2? But you could play Shenmue 3 without me. I could, but I don't want to play it without you. It was me and you played Shenmue 1, and you enjoyed it so I much. Did. So I want you to get the full Shenmue 3, 1, 2, and 3 experience. But also, I know, you know, time is limited. Shit. Where am I at? Am I in the right district? Oh, let's just talk to some guy. Excuse me. Excuse me. What is it? What is it? I'm looking for Zen Yu Shop. Zen Yu Shop. Which way is it? Is it like John's Quarter? Um, I think you can get there. I think you can get there. Thanks.
I'll try asking. I'll try asking. Um, Freddy says he'd like to start streaming Super Nintendo Super Famicom. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. The, the market's so saturated. It's like, I would just say, like, do it, right? Do it if you want to do it. But ain't no one watching this shit. Every now and then I'll get, like, maybe up to five people. Um, what's the most people I've had since I've streamed this year? Like, maybe four or five, six, something like that. Um, and then I started, like, interacting with people on, uh, Twitch, and, you know, I started talking to them, and they watched my shit, and I watched their shit, and, like, that was cool. And then Macy stopped taking naps, which, <laughs> Freddie says, I have too many kids to put that time into it tell me about it so earlier this year i uh was streaming real regularly i was playing a dreamcast game uh time stalkers and i'd get like maybe two two and a half hours a day like monday through friday it's also lifting consistently so you know some days more some days less three of those days i was you know getting my lifts in and then just out of nowhere, didn't Macy get a cold? And that just that was it. It's like she stopped taking. I used to put her down like clockwork. It's like, oh, snap time, here you go. And um, like that was just it. It was great. Um, uh, so yeah, right. Then she got sick. Yeah, she got a cold and just never slept for like six months. Then I got real like uh, frustrated about that. And um, all right, I'm gonna break off and get this map. White Dynasty. Oh, have I been to the White Dynasty quarter? Where are you going that way? I wanted to look at the tomato. Well, I see where the ladder is, or the stairs. Ladder. I see where the stairs are to get Baby, there. Are you okay? No, I think I'm having a stroke. Oh Have you, I can't do three things. Like, I'm, I'm monitoring two different conversations. A game, a conversation with you. Well, I, I'll stop talking. Well, that's not what I'm saying. It's just like, when I say stupid shit, it's because I'm not as sharp as I used to be. I don't get enough sleeps. Ooh. Let's spill some spaghetti. Real. So I've just got the one kid, and like streaming is a problem. Um, and then Nensen Dubois, what's what's your YouTube name? Is this a different uh, screen name? He says, it's funny, I remember a lot of your YouTube content, but I haven't really watched a lot of YouTube as much as I'd like these days, and on my own projects. Just bought a Super Famicom a few weeks ago. He also is a gentleman of culture and says dumb shit. Um, yeah, I don't. I barely watch YouTube anymore. Like, I used to keep up with Bithead1000, but once he got all those uh, juicy Patreon follow or like monies... And he started releasing like six videos a week, and they're all like an hour long. It's like, oh man, I love you, Bithead, but I'll catch up someday. Like, I powered through six years of his channel in like a couple months. You know, like I just worked my way through it. So that's kind of my plan here is just someday. Well, like when I when they wheel me in the retirement home, I'll, <laughs> I'll go through and watch some Bitheads. Uh, or if I see like a title that's real interesting, I'll be like oh hey let me jump on that right. yeah i just i don't remember the screen name nensen dubois so i wonder like did you leave a lot of comments back in the day because youtube used to be the shit i loved getting comments and now i think everyone's using their smartphones so no one no one leaves effing comments this might be ringing a bell I don't know, and then like I, I don't know, I for, just forget shit now. <laughs> I'm just slow. And I just sorry, man. The screen name's not ringing a bell with me. That bumps me out. 
like my commenters. I, I respond I to every comment. I know. At great length. And, uh... Leave all the thumbs up and likes as appropriate. Oh, yeah. This is the true Chinese experience. Everyone crammed on top of each other. I'm looking for that new shop. Which way is it to the Lucky Charm Quarter? Um, I think you can get there. Maybe the corner. Thanks. This, this guy. That's a cool shirt. Apparently, I gave this dude a Sega Saturn game. Oh, well, that's nice. I had a couple of Sega Saturn games. It was like nothing I was interested in. I was just like, who wants them? I remember giving Rob Maximum RD um, something. I probably shouldn't have gave away my cool Sega Saturn games now that I'm like full on horde mode. I think I had a giveaway once upon a time or something. It's like, do this, do that, and just get this shit out of my house. Um, the few channels that I do keep up with, I actually just... Uh, posted it on the Facebook, the Mondo Cool Facebook. It's like the first time I posted to that in a million years. Um, there's Three Blade Street. Um, or are we going to get a fight or something? Like is something cool going to happen? Man, my memory sucks. There was someone in Ohio. I gave him a game, too, like, more recently than... This probably happened in, like, 2010. Um, he used to comment on my stuff. I think I gave him, like, a... I think it was, like, while I knew you. I think part of a garage sale bundle, I got, like, a case for Metal Gear Solid 3, and he just, like, left a comment that he had a loose Metal Gear Solid 3, and it's like, ah, fight, <laughs> fate smiles upon you, my friend. Give me your address, and I'll give you the extra case and manual. I like when shit like that happens. But no, one of the YouTube channels that I, um... Oh, he's just a barber. Let's do it the Shenmue one way. Oh. This must be it. I just walked close enough to the sign. I was gonna walk in here and start asking around, like, the Shenmue one way where you gotta, like, it's like, look for this vague thing, and then you gotta, like, ask every person. Um... Retro Sanctuary. Look that up on YouTube. Retro Sanctuary. I think you have to put a hyphen in between it. It's these two British lads that um, sit in like the one guy's game room, I think. And every week on a Sunday, they release a video of them playing a game. And it's like fairly well produced, and the one guy's real knowledgeable about the games. And they get no views and no comments. They'll get like 35 views and I'm the only person that thumbs up and likes it. And just because they're a small channel, I'm like, I know that feel. No one watches my shit. Like, I put up my Cosmo Gang review. It's got less than 50 views. And it breaks my heart because that's such a cool game and I got it in such a cool way. So, I try to watch their videos. Like, I don't watch them every week. Sometimes I wait a while and then I... Like power through. I was watching one last night. That's what I'm thinking about. I was watching their video about Fire Shark, and um, so I like to leave comments on them. So I want to get those guys some views and comments because I think they deserve it. Because I don't want them to quit. <laughs> Let's see. You got a woodoo. Trim your hair while I tell you. 
And let me cut your hair, man. Is he like a Chinese sex pervert and he just wants to touch Rio's hot scalp? No, I was supposed to not touch it. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> Sorry, babe. I love you. I was... <laughs> babe, I'm sorry. I saw the flashing A. I was paying attention to this. Babe. <laughs> yeah. The desert bus thing was never for charity. That was a publicity stunt. Desert bus for charity does it for charity, and I told people to give to the charity. Um, they were testing your Pavlovian dog response. They want you to see the A and hit A. You're supposed to do nothing. He told you that. He did say that, but then I saw the A. And I thought, well, we need to hit the A. Now, you have to now, yeah, now I gotta find my way through like 18 quarters that all look the same. Babe, I'm sorry. It's okay. I wasn't paying attention. I was gonna answer this question in the chat. Well, um, you answer it now. No, I never did the desert bus for charity, it was a publicity stunt. I told people about the real charity. But I also was a fan of Pan Penn and Teller and wanted to, you know, get a point. I've told you about it before, right? Like, for every subscriber I got, I would drive one mile in Desert Bus, and I got, like, 350 or something. Which is, like, a couple of miles away from completing the game. So I was like, fuck it, let's go! And, uh, fuck it, we went. We made it. We got one point. <sighs> Look, babe, our one viewer appreciates it and thinks it's funny. So, we got that going for us. Is your, are you still watching the stream or is your phone off? My phone's off. Okay. I think Freddy might still be watching or it might be someone else. I don't know. Um, no, that's not what I want to do. I want that. Okay. I guess I'll pay the swindler. Thanks. Well, screw you too, buddy. I'm out here. Let's see what from yesterday does. Does that put me back where I was? Like, these are some of the quality of life improvements from Shenmue 1, but Shenmue 1 was in such a small area that, like, you know, starting from Rio's house every day wasn't a big deal. For helping, baby. Dude, I know. No. You need to pay attention. This is for you.
Dan? Dan Woodoo? That's my new alias. Dan Woodoo. Well, yeah. Of the Newport Woodoos. Babe, will you watch Kung Fu Hustle right. with me? I think it's still at my mom's house. Um, what made me think of that is there's these three martial arts dudes in it. There's a tailor, a barber, and then the other one's just like some bum that does odd jobs. And who are the three voodoo masters we just ran into? The bum... The barber and the what's it? Let me hold on. This is my favorite part of the stream when you stop the stream so you can. I like this uh, fight scene a lot. Well, we got to get a speaker going. That's unsubtitled in Chinese, but I hope you enjoy it. Because what? I like these guys. These are the Chinese Blues Brothers. You liked it. You also liked Shaolin Soccer and Journey to the West. Uh, this is, eh, whatever. We'll watch this again sometime. This is after they fight the one guy. It's not a great movie, but it's great, right? I wanted to see the earlier part when they were killing the other guys. Whatever. Stupid YouTube. Alright. Let's play. Let's get some voodoos. We gotta get the, the last voodoo, babe. I didn't even cut my hair. You told me to go left, right? Yep. Move it, heifer. I got kung fu business. Where'd that lady go? Yeah. Yes. Yes. The only other person is. Who is it? She's 
called Guiche and lives in the Yangtze apartment in the South Kangen Quarter. She's a master of Tai Chi. The Yangtze apartment in the South Kangen Quarter. Thank you. Isn't Tai Chi just stretching and looking stupid in the park? It's kind of bright, but... That's what I thought the first time I played this. Alright, where am I going? South Carmaine Quarter is what he said. Let me pretend like I know where the hell that is. Just run around like a retard. Actually, let's see what this exit up here is. Let's see where that takes us. I never watched that many Jet Li movies. The only Jet Li movie I watched, and it's just because when my mom was the electronics manager at Kmart, um, like damaged stuff, they couldn't sell it, so she'd bring home stuff, so like loose DVDs, and it's actually how I got my copy of uh, Metroid Prime for the GameCube. It was the Kmart exclusive wave bird that controller you had bundled with the game someone stole the controller so i got the game and i was like that's pretty cool and um or tried to I, I didn't get i don't think i got the controller i think i bought my wave bird but anyway um so i got this jet lee movie called the one and it's about like multiverse theory so he's like traveling from alternate dimension to alternate dimension and as he kills the other versions of himself he gains their power so there's like the bad Jet Li that's doing that and the good Jet Li so they're the last two and they've both been increasing in power so it's like right after the Matrix so it has all the like Matrix bullet time foo and man, don't roll your eyes that shit was cool <clears throat> Is this the golden quarter? I know where I'm going, babe. I know. I'll use the map. The, the maps don't make sense to me. Do you see where I'm the red dot? Yeah. And the red line is the next area. So I'm but going tell you to the, what next, the area. next area. Is. This sign does. This white dynasty quarter. And then Golden Quarter is where I think I'm at. So I, I'm going to go down to the next one. Because South Carmain is like near the beginning of the game. So I think that's just another exit to the area I came from. Do you want to dick around in the arcade? Sure. Let's see if I can find the arcade. Somewhere along this main street. What's Moon Cafe? Okay. Okay, that's the end of the line, so it's down. Oh, wait, now it's right here. Now, I can't play the cool games. Yeah, doesn't he, like, go into the alternate reality where his girlfriend's still alive or wife or whatever? Uh, the games list on the Genesis Mini looks pretty sweet to me. Um, and then it's got those two exclusives, that, what, that version of Tetris and... God, what is it? Is it a Thunder Force game or something? I was looking at them at Myers. I don't know what part of the country you're from. It's like a grocery store, like a Walmart, but not full of shitty poor people. And, uh, yeah, you know it's true. And, um, anyway, I was looking at some on the shelf, and they had plenty, and I thought, hmm, like I want it, but I also... 
I don't know. If I get this new job, I'll go buy one because, like, who cares? Be shitting dollars. Darius 2. Thank you, Freddy. So, I mean, like, yeah, the Sega Genesis Mini looks really cool. If I found one under the Christmas tree, I'd be excited, but I don't know that I'd ask for that, you know? I don't know. I just wanted to dick around with QTE machine game. I like, I like QTE machine. God damn, how's it 11? Didn't the baby go to bed early tonight? Babe, you want to try this? No. Check. I did a lot better the last time. I unironically enjoy the QuickTime arcade machine. Because I'm not super familiar with this controller, so it's good practice for later in the game. Because there's this part coming up, babe, where it's like a really cool action sequence, but it's goddamn hard. I remember getting so frustrated and having to do it so many times. We haven't even met. I think the guy's name is Ren. Rio gets a buddy in this game. He looks like a pirate. See, like, I don't like when it goes to the D-pad part. Because this, like, I don't need to practice the up, down, left, rights. I don't. I hit the button. It's just this shitty D-pad sucks. I might switch controllers. Man. Alright. Yeah, for 60 bucks, that makes it a lot better. Does it come with two controllers? Or just one? I'm going to play the other QTE game. Nice. Yeah, it comes with two controllers. We can play Ghouls and Ghosts on it, I think. I love that game. The People like the Sega version... It was licensed by Capcom and Sega made it. Babe, you want to try this? Oh. Babe, try it. It's only five bucks. 
All I gotta do is go hustle some dice mans. Man, I hit the right button. Fuck you. <laughs> okay. So all the crusty old ladies at work are pissed because they're doing box lunch day tomorrow instead of Thanksgiving day. Uh -huh. And in the past, they got box lunches for everyone. Like, you could show up even if it's not your scheduled day and get one. Uh -huh. And um, not so. It's only for people scheduled. Now, how much you want to bet tomorrow's the day the fewest amount of people are scheduled yeah. to come in? And guess who? Um... The lady I was complaining yeah. about. The one who talks like this. I would have to ride the bus to come here to get my lunch. And, uh, they don't even have... <laughs> like, look, they're nice lunches. Maybe she doesn't have anywhere to go for Thanksgiving. Maybe. She's really excited about her box lunch. I like the box lunch, too. I was sitting here thinking, uh, since I got that meeting tomorrow, you might just... on the way back, go get that box lunch, because they're nice uh, little lunchies. But you can't, because you have to be working? Correct, you have to be scheduled. And I was like, shit, maybe I'll like sign up for an hour overtime and be like, where my lunch box is. Like, what comes in this lunch box? Um... In the past years, it's always been like a turkey sandwich, a pickle, potato salad, a little bag of chips. I mean, it's free, so like, it's like pretty good. It's like from some catering company. You've seen them before, and I think it comes like, it might come with like a brownie or something. I don't know. If it does, I usually, I either give them to Sierra or give them to like some bozo at work. Shit, what? Oh no, I'm by where I live. You wonder what? I don't want to go to my holiday party. Your family's thing? Or no, the work the one? one? Work. It's like with the new group of people that I don't know. I'm a million months pregnant. <laughs> like, I don't want to go. Yeah, but you can show me off my cool new suit. No, I think I just get to go. Oh. Why can't the family come? I think it's just... I mean, be, it used to be that, um, no, actually your family couldn't come then either. What is it? What is it? But it used to be at the headquarters and they had everybody from Care Source. So, you know, like the president would be there, like just everybody. And then now, I think as a, as a cost saving measure, they have it where each department creates their own holiday party. So, this is ours. It's going to be Alright, it's nice seeing you in the chat room. Nensen. That's hard for me to say. Um, me. He's going to bed. So, no. now each individual department is having their own party. I was listening. I was listening to your story. Is her hair green? Babe, I was listening. So it's a cost-saving measure. Each department's in charge of their own party. Yeah, and ours is that thing. Is at what thing? At the Morris Center. What? In the conference room. Yeah? I was just straightening them out. That's it. That's my story. Oh, okay. Sorry I interrupted the thrilling conclusion. <laughs> Shut up. The Pam Morris Center, you say? Shut up. Um... Well, I was just like in the middle of the story. <laughs> Bye, Nelson. Like, it's been great seeing you. I'm almost done. He said he's going to bed. So I'm saying, like, look, I got two people in the chat. I'm going to talk to them, babe. <laughs> and they're not even in the same chat room. They can't even talk to each other. 
Freddy pre-ordered the Turbo Graphics Mini. I forgot about that thing. Oh, now yeah. that I want. Yeah. That I want. It's got some of the CD games on it. Um, I want the Sega Genesis Mini too. I got the whole collection so far. I got the Nintendo and the Super Nintendo, so I got... Well, no, I guess I don't have the PlayStation Mini. <laughs> I should have got them when they were 20 bucks. I don't know if they're still around like that. Thank you very much. Is this how I buy the map for the next quarter? I think it's got the Ease books 1 and 2 turbo CD games in English, which is dope. Where's someone to take me to the place? I'm going to learn Tai Chi with this guy. Hell yeah. I'll answer any of your questions afterwards. How about it? It's Kung Fu Rassel. Right. Ah, wonderful. Then let's begin. Nah, uh, the At Games Atari flashbacks, now. Nah. Why is this guy so good? He doing the crane kick? Sweep the legs! Babe, I unironically enjoy the YouTube Red original series, uh, Cobra Kai. Even when they're doing, like, the stupid narratives that I hate, like, I still enjoy it. Yeah, that's right. Oh, what the hell is that move? I guess they didn't want to put in the game where you beat up an old man. <laughs> And Balzac told me I got to spar that guy. That was more of just button mashing and looking retarded. Hold on, I need a drink. In the game, I need... You wonder why you have no money? I got the shakes, baby. Babe, I want like 200 wing wangs. Which one would you get? Jack? I guess. I think we got that one last time. We did. So, we, like, which one do you think will fuck you one. up the most? This one? Yeah. This one. Yeah, that one looks like a party in a can. Probably green tea. <laughs> I told you that my mom, when we were at the dentist, she was going, um, like, they were talking about how much their, her teeth were going to be, and she's like, well, I don't really want to pay that much, because I'm almost 80, and I'm going to die soon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I have fucking lame. That's embarrassing. I... I don't know, Ben. I'm like, well, you're still going to need to have teeth. Like, what do you do? Well, that doesn't mean she needs ten thousand dollar teeth. Yeah. Like, does she get two thousand dollar teeth? Yeah. Because they only need to last a few years. Who's 
this guy? Is that Petey Wheatstraw? Let me fight him. Come on, game. Yeah, here we go. Let's die. Will you bring me a delicious apple? Will you bring me two delicious apples? Okay. This is the kung fu move the old guy taught me. Not that. I learned this all on my own. I call it getting my shit slapped. <laughs> I'm not sure what the Neo Geo Pro stick is. Is it like some sort of stick with Neo Geo games? <laughs> How the hell do I get back to Manmo? I don't know. <sighs> okay, do you need anything else while I'm upstairs? Nah, yeah, just a couple of those delicious, delicious apples. I'm gonna eat them all. The mini mouse apples? Yeah. I can't wait till Disney sells me absolutely everything I need to live, just like that red letter media sketch <laughs> predicted. They called it the Basic Life Needs app or something. I don't know. That's what I thought as soon as I saw that Minnie Mouse on the apple. Oops. Yep, dead end. Alright. Do do do. Do 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 Man, man, no herb this. Huh. Yeah, you can tell how closely I've been following video games lately. I just sort of... I don't know, man. What are, they, what are they releasing for me anymore? You know, it's just like everything's... Some... I don't know, political agenda... Bull honky... It's like modern games have, have left me behind there's you know like i got real excited about dragon quest 11 huh that's pretty dope i've never been wild about the neo geo uh controller layout though uh, is that the way i want to go I feel like that's the way I want to go. I like 
I don't like all four buttons laid out. If it was two and then two under it, like I feel, that'd be more comfortable. That's why I like the Neo Geo CD controller. Like the, you know, controller controller. I'm also a console pleb. Like I didn't spend a lot of time at arcades when I was a kid. Sorry, the visitors are not allowed right now. <sighs> I'm here for Master Mo. I want to ask you something. Oh, Master Mo. Oh, okay. Let me let me throw this in the Google machine. I want to meet him. Can I go in? No, we're cleaning the temple now. Okay, yeah, that looks pretty dope. I like the button layout on this thing. I think that does fix my chief complaint. Are these my only options? Only want to go inside for a short while. No, I cannot give you permission myself. As soon as I meet Master Mo, I will leave. No matter what you say, I cannot let you in. I won't get in your way while you're cleaning. I just want to see Master Mo. Guess I gotta intrude, huh? Now, I should get 
Yeah, I haven't seen... I wonder how much Sega would mind, like, letting you, Suzuki, put his properties in there. From what I've seen, and just, like, popping in random streams, uh, streams, it's been mostly in rural areas. The most prolific thing I've seen has been the, uh, wood chopping minigame. And I saw some turtle races. Somewhere in this game there's duck races, and I need to find... I never found those the first time I played it. Oh shit, is that where I buy the map? Like, there's a few, uh... Shit. There's a few, um... Original mini games like darts and the quick time events, you know, they might have an arcade full of like unique original creations. All right, but all. Sorry, but you'll have to kiss my grits. Tricking you, Rio. All right, I'll do it. Then start here. Wipe the walls clean. I have to give service in the library. doing here I think Rio just got mesothelioma from breathing this shit.
quit cleaning the same damn spot, you dingus. It's a pretty bold choice making the game like have a extended 20 minute cleaning session.
I got suckered into cleaning up the temple. It's a horrible idea. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, my vehicle registration came in the mail today. Gotta pay an extra fee on my stupid truck. Why? License plate. Oh, for your birthday. For my truck. Yeah. Babe, why do you guys all have these birthdays? In the winter. In the winter, right? The winter right babies. I like spring babies. Why? That's when you're supposed to have babies, isn't it? No, that's when you're supposed to get knocked up. And then you have your winter baby. I don't think that's correct. It is. And then you're all healed up and ready to go work the wheat fields. And then the thaw comes. Fuck you. <laughs> get out in the wheat field. Alright. You want to do this part? No. Why not? I'm going to go to bed. I'm wiping off the walls to find the voodoo, but Rio got suckered into cleaning. It was like some real Huckleberry Finn shit. He's like, oh yeah, cleaning's fun. You want to do it? He's like, okay. Is he going to get paid? No. He finds the voodoo. Apparently, I can't eat an apple. And look at this notepad. Look at this notepad. I don't think it shows up on the cam very well. That's Donkey Kong 64 banana notes. I got a lot of Donkey Kong stuff. Like, I got a banana pen. Donkey Kong 64 sucks. I hate that game. It was made when Rare's like, every game's just going to be find items forever, and that's all you do. Collect the items. You have to clean this whole thing. Until I find, I found three of the four. I haven't found the one that I need yet. <laughs> but I'm running out of wall. Will you find it for me? Thank you. What do you think Disney put into these apples to make them so good? Sorry for schlomping into the microphone. <laughs> Jeez, it's going to be the last patch of wall. Why don't you go down there first? <clears throat> no. I'm just some wall. I think when you told me to move, I skipped over the area that it is. Well, where do you think it is, babe? Like, can you... Why are there just these spots? Like, because that's... It's hard to pilot Rio. And, like, that's as much cleaning as he does. So, I mean, like, can you go to the top of the wall at the bottom? Or is it just... No, like it's, it's just these little patches. Here, you, why don't you try it? No, I'm going to bed.
I want to go to bed, but I also want to get the Woodoo and get the next big event. Did you wash these apples off? Yeah. Okay. Do you really think I just bring you, like, the dirty apples? I mean, do you really even need to wash apples? Yeah, they have pesticides on them. Do they? Are we sure about that? Frozen too. Can we go take Macy to see Frozen? Hell no. She would love that. She hasn't seen Frozen 1. She doesn't she care doesn't about care. Elsa. She'd be pretty excited to see that snowman. Every time she sees that snowman, she gets fucking crunk. I know. She really liked her nighttime walk. Uh huh. Her Christmas lights on. Oh, I bet, yeah. I bet. Yeah. So she got, it's like, lights, they're so pretty, I love them. And I was like, it's okay. She's a little bit, um, dramatic. Every time we say bye, we say bye, I love you. So that's why she says bye, I love you to everything. Like, when we left Matt's house, she's like, we were in the truck, Matt didn't hear. She's like, bye, Matt, love you. <laughs> There it is. No, you stupid idiot. He was just the cook. How's she know? eating an apple. No hell, I got a block button. That's good, you know. Babe, how much do you think a manual for Shenmue 2 on the Xbox costs? Why don't you look that up on eBay for me? Just a manual. Because my copy doesn't have a manual. Blush. Thank you. Well, these are all the game and the manual. How much are they? Eighteen dollars. 
Yeah. Not that bad. I wouldn't pay 20 bucks just to get the manual. Ugh. All right, let's slap this heifer shit up. Yeah, like everyone's just dodging all the time. I'll go to sleep after this. Or I'll turn this off at least. Well, it's midnight. I need to go to bed because I got to get up for my stupid... So do I not have to sleep in the flop house anymore? Hopefully not. Hopefully shacking up with shoe wing is free. Who's this lady? Is she going to the Kung Fu temple? Excuse me. How can I help you? Mm. Do you know a person named Shu Wing Hong? Is that Chinese nanners? Any information would be helpful. Do you know anything? Someone in the neighborhood might be able to tell you something, I suppose. I see. I'll try asking. I'll try asking. Alright. I'm shutting her down for the night. That's the lady we just talked to. I know. She's just asking if she knows the alias. Yeah. Don't we have to find her? No, that's the lady in the blue dress we just talked to. I know, but then she said she, we were supposed to follow her to the apartment. Yeah, well, I'm closing the game. For, I, it's midnight, I gotta go to bed, I gotta get up at 8, I need to get sleep. I have a very important day tomorrow. We'll continue Shenmueing tomorrow. Maybe we'll ask my mom to stay for a while. And then me and you can just come down here and play for a couple hours. No, because I have to work late. Fuck that. Fuck that. Alright, I'm shutting the stream down. Alright, take it easy, Freddy. Thanks for hanging out in the chat room for a bit. And I think that's the only people watching. Alright, we're shutting down.